Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. Our scripture reading this morning is coming from Psalm uh, 23, a favorite passage of scripture. And it talks about uh, the shepherds as the good shepherd. And every verse of this psalm uh, points to the Lord as our shepherd, not was, was, or will be the ever present. The Lord is our shepherd. It reads as follows. The Lord is my shepherd. I shall not want. He makes me to lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside the still waters. He restores my soul. He leadeth me in the path of righteousness for his name's sake. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for thou art with me. Thy rod, thy staff, they comforted me. Thou prepared the table before me in the presence of mine enemy. Thou anointest my head with oil, my cups runneth over. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord. Praise scripture reading. Again, this psalm is very familiar and one of the favorites of mine because when I need to feel or be reminded of just who God is, I go to that psalm and it reminds me of the Lord is my ever present helper. He's with me. He's leading and guiding me. And he said, he leads me besides the still waters. When trouble comes in my life, I can remember and reflect on that, yes, he's going to take me to where there's calmer and a peaceful day in my life. He's lead me around all of the troubles. He helped me. He go, and matter of fact, he goes with me through the troubled waters. And when I, my spirit is disquieted, he's there to comfort me with his rod and his staff. So I have no reason to fear. The only reason I have is to just trust God for every, in every situation for whatever it is that I need. Because the very first scripture, first in this scripture tells me the Lord is my shepherd and the shepherd cares for his sheep. And the other phrase that I shall not want. He provides so graciously for all of my, I'm using it personal, my needs, because I want you, the hearer, to internalize it and take the same uh, thought and attitude that the Lord is your shepherd. And whatever it is that we need, he will pro provide it. And he does so, so graciously. And we can reflect on our lives. We'll see and recognize the Lord is all days there with us, and whatever we need, he provides it. And I just ask you to carry this with you throughout the day. In the closing verse, he said, his goodness and his mercy will be with us always. And the other part that I like, I know I was going to close with, that he appeals, he anoints us with his spirit, Then he anoints us so well, he just overflows our cup. Just remember, the Lord is our shepherd, your shepherd, my shepherd. Have a blessed day.